This is the destruction of the South Tower of the World Trade Center, viewed from a helicopter to the south. This particular video clip is rich in details that call the official story into question. Notice the numerous explosions on the west side of the building, above the impact point. As the top 30 floor section falls, it tips to the east. It starts off intact, but then it disintegrates in mid-air. Gravity alone could not cause the top section to disintegrate. When an object is in free fall, there are no internal stresses. It should have hit the ground in one piece, but it didn't. Some of the debris is clearly being accelerated by forces other than gravity. These effects can be caused by late firing explosives, which can produce a white smoke trail. White smoke, consisting of aluminum oxide, is a byproduct of the thermite reaction. While producing this video, I ran across one rocket projectile I had not seen commented on before. This one stopped mid-air and changed directions. Even taking perspective effects into account, this projectile lost one component of momentum and gained another. That requires an impulse. Note that the rocket trail does not point back to the building, but the point where the impulse occurred. Let's take it from the top. There's a lot going on. Watch for the smoking guns.